Well, two cars you've never seen before. There's a 95 Accord Sedan DX. This is going to be in another video. I've had it for about three, three weeks, -ish, something like that. Anyway, got this today, $400. Apparently it has a blown head gasket, but I just drove it um, about 75, 80 miles or some shit like that without any overheating issues. Part of that was going up a big hill. It is a GL wagon, Subaru, four-wheel drive. It has the factory fog lights. Even has little Subaru covers. It's on snow tires that are kind of bald. Paint's in good shape other than a shit ton of tree sap. Because it was parked under a pine tree for about, I have no idea, probably a couple years. Toe hook or hitch. Four wheel drive. It's missing the gas cap. I need to get one of those. Roof rack. A little dent right there. It's got a couple little dings. Nothing too major. Get in here. All power windows, they all work. A little slow, need to be greased, but they do work. Factory fog switch, headlight switch. Wipers, heating, the fan switch does not work. He said he jumped the fan and it turned on, so there must be some bad in the switch. Or fire it. Original radio works. Runs like a carbureted car. Once she warms up, she idles great. One fog works. One doesn't, one has that doesn't. Need to get some bold. My battery. <laughs> I have no idea where the throttle cable is. I'm trying to find it. It's getting dark on me. Yeah, it's too dark to find it. Yeah, she runs smooth once it's all warmed up. Right now it's barely idling because it's cold. That's funny. Lights blinking as it misses. Yeah. She's in great shape otherwise. Had to give her a lot of cleaning. She was really dirty. Spiders everywhere. Had to scrub that stain out of the seat. And that, she's pretty good. Top of the door panels are worn. Plenty of space back here. Back seats. It has the original owner's manual. 
along with the warranty information. Welcome to welcome to Subaru of Southern California. It was from Pasadena. That's upside down, but you get the point. It's got original tire information. Everything. And I'll come back here and I'll show you the fog covers. Shut this off right now. Of course, the cat struts are blown out. All kinds of stuff in here. But yep, there's the fog light covers. Both of them. That's freaking awesome. Freaking awesome. You ever listen to the tailgate to a Subaru? Yeah. It's not light. Start, she runs, she drives, she's got tunes, and dual range four wheel drive, high and low. Which was one of the biggest reasons to buying it, plus that space. Which is a lot roomier than that little trunk. Yeah. She's comfortable too. Drives smooth at 55. Didn't push it over that. It's in 55 speed limit zone. It's on a non op, so I should not have been driving it. But I had to get it home. Tags say September 12. Super GM. Yeah. I love that tow hitch. That's going to get used. Trust me. Subaru. Anyway, it's getting dark. I'm not going to be able to see shit in a minute. Just wanted to post a video of this as it is freaking awesome. That's pretty nice too. I got that for 500 bucks. It was the ugliest color in the whole world and it had huge side skirts and body kit stuff with all kinds of skulls and scorpions and all kinds of weird shit all painted on it. And Headlights were spray painted black, the tail lights were painted black, everything was black, and the rest of the car was painted like brown, and the interior is mostly blue. But I got a bunch of stuff from the junkyard for this to start cleaning it up. And yeah, so. Two new cars you guys have never seen before, you guys have also probably not seen another 95 Accord. My stepdad's 95 Accord EX Coupe. That's a DX sedan. That is a Subaru GL. Station wagon with four wheel drive. Needs a five inch lift and four big mud tires.